In 2020, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service determined that tufted puffins weren't going to get protections under the Endangered Species Act. And when they made that decision, they identified some data gaps in tufted puffins. Those being, what are the birds eating and feeding their chicks? Are the birds related to the tufted puffins in Alaska genetically? And are bald eagle populations in Oregon perhaps having an impact on nesting success? My name is Noah Delinajek, and I'm a graduate student with Oregon State University's Seabird Oceanography Lab, which is affiliated with the Hatfield Marine Science Center in Newport, Oregon. In the 70s and 80s, puffins in Oregon went from 5,000 birds and declined over the span of a few decades to 400 birds. And we don't really know what caused that decline. So first, we're making um, an effort to collaborate with coastal beachgoers and um, volunteers to pick up a beached tufted puffin. Within the first few days that a bird is beached, you can still take feather or blood samples from that bird and get accurate genetic analysis. So we can compare that to the genetic analysis that they've done with the Alaskan population. And if there's a distinct difference between the two, that's a, a clue that maybe the Oregon birds um, had split off at some point and they're their own population. Um, secondly, we're doing um, something called disturbance data, which is where we watch to see how often and how long bald eagles are interacting with tufted puffin colonies. And we're taking that data right here at Haystack Rock in Cannon Beach. Thirdly, we are building a website called Birds with Fish. We're calling on all photographers along the coastline that have experience taking pictures of birds to submit photographs that they've taken of tufted puffins, but also other coastal birds that have fish so that we can create a database of what our coastal birds are eating, when, and how it's changing over time. And that kind of information can be really useful for deciding how to move forward with management and conservation of tufted puffins and other coastal birds that are experiencing similar dynamics. Tufted puffins are um, an emblematic species of the Oregon coast. Our goal is basically to raise the awareness that's necessary about learning more about Oregon tufted puffins and taking that information and hopefully creating a structure to move forward with management and conservation. And of course, projects like that require some funding assistance. Oregon Wildlife Foundation has given us a gracious grant to support our first season and donations from folks to our project go towards us managing volunteer groups and getting people um, engaged in our project, taking coastal communities and, and collaborating on this project together to get out and learn more about these birds um, and, and save this iconic species along the Oregon coast.